Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to get Facebook Marketplace back on Android or iPhone. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. So the first thing that we need to do here is we need to access our Facebook app. Now, once we access that, what we need to do next is basically log in into our account. Now, once you've logged in, we are now ready to change a few things here. So in order for us to actually view or get Marketplace back into our mobile device. Now in this case, at the top right here, go ahead and click on your profile icon. Or if you don't have any profile picture yet, you should be able to see a tree bar icon. Now from here, you want to scroll down a bit here and you want to open up the settings and privacy section. And from here, choose the option that says settings. Now under settings, what we need to do is you need to scroll down a bit and look for preferences. Now under preferences, you need to look for the option that says navigation bar. Now from here, what we need to do next is we need to click on the manage uh, or customize the bar section. And from here, you should be able to see your shortcuts bar. Now in this section, you should be able to see the available shortcuts as well as the hidden shortcuts. Now, as you can see, we have marketplace here. So in this case, you need to change this to a different one. So I would suggest you to choose either auto or pin. Now, in this case, auto would actually personalize it. So for example, if you're not fre frequently using it, it's going to hide it automatically. But if you're frequently using it, it's going to be pinned into your profile. So in this case, we want to choose the pin option here. And that would actually get your marketplace back into your account or your Facebook app here. And in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.